What is today? Uh, Today's okay. Friday. Which is mostly just exciting because I'm done with the stressful week. Two midterms done. No idea how I did on them. I might have failed them, but you know what they say. Ignorance is bliss. And I have my breakfast sandwich and muffin. So this bliss is uh, about to be very tasty. Feels good. Gonna go get some editing done, the final tweaks on a video I've been working on, and then uh, then I'm gonna get to the point of this video, why you click on this video most likely. I'm so excited, I'm so excited. Oh, hi there. Where are the donuts? Uh, white box. Dude, Logan's totally brown nosing us. <laughs> And Logan's the cheapest dude I know. I know. So I for him to buy us anything. Well, was... Yeah, so basically the stove, or was the stove or oven? oven yeah. The oven was left on for like a while, and so it was super it hot in here. Like... And so the gas bill is probably gonna be really high. It had to be like 12 hours. Jeez. Okay, so um, because of that, it was like most definitely probably Logan, because I've never even used the oven ever. So, anyways, to like make us feel better, he got us donuts, which I'm not complaining about. Video is rendering. Uh, I just finished actually the uh, video from the 5k that I filmed. I don't know if you guys watched that vlog from before. Anyways, so excited. All day I've been thinking about this. I'm so excited. Yo! Alright, oh, like this. Oh! <laughs> I'm so excited. Dude, it's so sick. Okay, here. My name's Buddy. I do tech and like other reviews on my channel. So, and then along with Goober, he's also on the channel and does some gaming stuff. So be sure to check our channel out, guys. It'll be linked in the description. Link so the he's description. doing like an unboxing video and first review thing, and I'm just here along for the ride. Um, but of oh, the iPhone 10, Dude, not the, the iPhone, iPhone X, the <laughs> iPhone 10. <laughs> Either one, yeah. I don't I've heard people care about it. I heard, really? I heard people are getting upset about calling it the X, which I think sounds way cooler. Does it look cooler now? Clearly this one's better. Better colors, a wider lens, which is nice. The iPhone 7 Plus did a good job. Certainly, like, decent, but not as good as the, the 10. Oh my god! Can you send that to us? Now right, let's get into it. Okay. First on the list, we have speed. I think once we get the gestures down and they become second nature, it'll be lightning fast. And right now it's like, it's performing fast, but we're kind of messing up. It's almost just like user error. Yeah, yeah. Think. The camera. I'm at a loss for words. The camera on this phone, on this phone, is incredible. It's comparable when you're shooting outside and most normal things to this camera that I'm shooting on now, the Canon 80D. With photo, you have portrait mode both on the front facing and back facing cameras. And it's still not perfect, but it's pretty good, especially if you're in good lighting outside. You're gonna get some pretty cool shots with it. So now I'm gonna go through the modes, which is really cool, because like after you take it, you can just change. Oh, that almost got it right. See, it almost gets it right. I feel like yeah, you have to be real particular about it. I mean, it thinks what that piece of like brick is in my. Yeah. <laughs> it's so close. Perfect. You just have to be real. I think you have to be really careful about where you take these pictures and if you're going to try to use that mode. So we didn't have much luck with that. I'm, we're still not really sure like how to make that work. But the other effects like stage light or the spotlight, what are they called? Studio um, and contour light, they look really good and you can get some really incredible photographs with them. Paying $1,000 for this, you definitely want a nice camera and this definitely gives you a nice camera. Uh, the video 4K at 60, uh, 60 frames, that's crazy. I'll be interested to see some reviews, um, this versus like Pixel 2, other, mm -hmm. other smartphones that are introducing um, portrait mode. But yeah, the dynamic range in both photo and video looks really good, I'm really impressed by that. So overall the camera, I mean the camera's like the thing I was most excited to find out about when like it was announced, which is crazy because it's just on your phone, which is, the, which is the coolest part about it. Like anybody can take a good picture now. Yeah, anybody. Feel the hand, definitely right as you grab this thing out of the box, it feels solid. It feels like you're getting exactly what you paid for. It feels almost a tiny bit thicker than the iPhone 8 or the previous iPhones, and it definitely has a little bit more grip to it. Even though like it's all glass and you'd think it'd be super slippery, I've held tons of iPhones and this definitely feels like one that will stay in your hand a lot better than the other ones. Like other ones, I definitely need like a pop socket, you said, or a case on it because I'd be afraid I'm gonna drop it. This, definitely not that feel. Love the bigger power button mm -hmm. so you don't have to reach up as high. 
and with a phone that has the whole thing being screen, it definitely, if you don't have a good grip on it, you really would be worried, but this one you definitely have. It feels great. If you're going from like the like the plus versions of any phone, you'll have no problem. Mm -hmm. It's pr same decent reachability. All right, so now let's talk about Face ID, one of the coolest features about this new iPhone. I was pretty impressed with how well it picked up the face um, whenever you took it out of your pocket and looked at it. We had some trouble, I think, like when thing when the phone was um, on a table. Because that's something that like, at least I do all the time. I have my phone like next to my notebook or next to my computer. And it didn't perform as well as I would have liked in that regard. Which we don't know if that just takes some getting used to or like if um, yeah, knowing we the weren't feel turning our head feel. enough. For all like walking around purposes, other than it being on a table, I think it worked really well. iOS 11 on the 10 is different. But I like it. I think the gestures are really cool and it'll allow me to be like more fluid. But it just takes some getting used to. But again, like I don't think that's a thing that should turn you away from getting this phone if you're interested. Same with some of like the multitasking. It's just like, why is that a thing? You know? Yeah. Like, and again, this is just our first impression. We've had the phone for a few hours. The emojis are fun. Animojis are awesome. They are so much fun. That's so cool. <laughs> What's up guys, I want to thank you so much for watching this video. Make sure to hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you tomorrow. <laughs> In class, I'll just be like a bunch of random people like... <laughs> You're a panda. <laughs> you could spend all day. I feel like Apple even like will consider making it longer, yeah. and adding a ton more faces, mm -hmm. because people just will eat that up. Yep, because it's just like the Snapchat filters, like people yeah, love just... them. I'm one of those people that always wants the latest and greatest, and my mom has the phone, or she's about to get it, and I'm not getting it anytime soon, so I'm like super jealous of it in that regard. The camera's such an important feature on this phone that if you don't plan on using it that much, you might as well save money elsewhere. The other software um, features that you, you get are really cool and you might really enjoy, um, but that price point is really high. If you like taking a lot of photos, um, which like, you're into tech a lot, if you're into <laughs> tech um, and you have the money, this is definitely a phone for you. But I think it's just more exciting to see like where phones in the future will go. Like this mm -hmm. is this is like the future of, of the iPhone. Um, so maybe you won't get it now, but you will end up getting it. And I think you will end or up getting it. the next generation. Hope you guys enjoyed this little review. Let me know if you're thinking about getting this at all. And go check out Ryan's channel. He's gonna put together a really cool video from all the other stuff that we shot today. I know the intro is good. I don't know how <laughs> and then leave any questions down below, because now we're experts. <laughs> Pretty much. <laughs> Two hours of use. <laughs> <laughs>